Morning, Angel Engine Car were clean. We're in Nottingham this morning, first one of the day. We've got a Skoda Fabia VRS 1.9 diesel. So a 2006 model, 104,000 on the clock. Now the owners used this before on the uh, the Lexus. Uh, you can see in the background just there. Um, got us back today. He's only had this two weeks. Wanted to get it cleaned up. Uh, done a couple of bits and pieces. This this is modified. Uh, intake system, exhaust system. Got a map on it. Um, there is future work planned for this. Um, uh, one of the main things we uh, saw when we lifted the tip on it was the engine was uh, vibrating slightly um, uh, on one side, more of a wobble. So you've got the overall engine vibration, we've got that wobble as well. Now that's normally engine mounts or clutch related. Now one of the first things we checked on this, get the clutch in and out and uh, that vibration disappears. So there's definitely uh, um, a flywheel um, bouncing off the back of the engine. Now that has stopped. Now we're about 15 minutes into the clean. Uh, we've got the engine smoothed out and quietened down considerably um, and that stopped that doing that. It's not fixed the problem because the engine's not vibrating as much as it was. Uh, it's not impacting the uh, the idle now. Um, big thing of note on this, so the owner had been worn up for about 20 minutes before we got here. It was only at 71 degrees. Uh, the hottest we've got this to is 78. We don't even need to do a thermostat test on this. Um, it, is, uh, it is running cold. Uh, there's potentially some engine mount wear on one of the mounts. One's already been replaced. So he's got a, a list of things to do, got it for a bargain. Um, got a list of things to do on this just to get it running back to its best. Running so much smoother and quieter already. Uh, one of the injectors is overfueling slightly as well. But again, uh, what we got, a what, 14 year old car, a few bits and pieces to sort out. Um, those injectors look like they're trimming in already. It's just down to a clutch, an engine mount and a thermostat on a car of this age, that's not too bad at all. Um, otherwise, it seems to be running pretty nicely. No other codes or issues in the system. Got about another 20 minutes to go and get this back out on the road.